Hey, what's up everybody? Chris Souter, Slender Cat Outdoors, and welcome to Sunrise Flatheads. We are getting ready to hit the high river again this morning and uh, been back in this creek catching some bait. Got some bait, it was tough, it was tough, but we got bait. Gonna hit the high river today, try to get some flatheads before it gets too hot, before all the pleasure boaters come out. It's, uh, it's already hot. I'm soaking wet from catching bait, but uh, we're gonna see if we can get it done. Sunrise Flatheads, here we come. So I think a good game plan for this morning is gonna be starting a little bit closer to the bank, try to catch these, uh, these fish that are still kind of up shallow feeding, getting ready to move back out a little bit deeper. And I'm gonna start on some wood. Uh, I had my daughter out there a couple days ago and, and uh, we was fishing wood a little bit deeper, but uh, we, do, we was doing pretty good. So let's find some wood and get set up on it. This is the kind of stuff we wanna look for. You can see all this stuff just riddled on the on the side imaging there this is all wood and you can see this is kind of an obvious place you got a lot of wood stacked up on the bank we're gonna get anchored up get some baits out there see if we can't put some fish in the boat this morning so the baits we're gonna be using today we got some moon eye we're just gonna chunk this up like we normally do nice and fresh I'm just gonna make a couple chunks out of it. And big old skipjack. Now these, all this come from the High River here local. Oh, that's nice. Now I'm gonna cut some medium to big size chunks this morning. Hopefully get on a big old flathead. Nice two, two and a half inch pieces. We even cut a small piece off his tail. And we got some gizzard shad we'll put on live too. A lot of my fish here lately have been coming off this moon eye. And these are about average size for the high river. First bait we're gonna put out there Live gizzard chad. Now I'm gonna stagger baits, different baits. This next piece I'm gonna put a big old body section of that moon eye on. Now even though we're fishing closer to the bank, we're still in a little bit deeper water. We're still in you know 25 to 30 foot of water, but we are very close to the bank and we, we want to cast. We want to take advantage of that. We want to cast right up on the bank because they could be working that bank line this morning as that sun comes up. Put one of those big old section of skipjack bodies on. Always check that hook point. Make sure you get them scales off of it. And then that's one that's got a float on it. We'll stick it out there in the middle for possible blue cat. I'm gonna put that big old skipjack head on. This is one of my favorite baits. I mean, I love gizzard shad, but these big old skipjack heads, that's just a, that's just a big fish bait right there. Love it. And I'm gonna, I'm gonna cast that joker straight out into the middle of the river off that ledge hopefully get a blue cat or a big old flathead that's travel on that ledge.
Yeah, there we go. Little piece of skipjack. Moved out here in some harder current. Still in wood, still in that 30 foot range. But we definitely got more current out here. Water temperature's 74 degrees. A little on the stain side, it was getting greened up. But got more rain come in. Kind of muddy thing back up a little bit. This feels like a decent fish, but like I said, we got a bunch of current where we're at. When I set up on this, I kind of figured we'd catch blue cat. This feels like a flathead, small flathead. Mr. Flathead. Drag him up here in this current. three-way rig little piece of skipjack pretty yellow thing yellow flyhead nice I give you guys an idea how much current we have I put a couple down rods as I was dropping anchor I marked a fish it was right underneath of us so I dropped a couple down rods straight down and I've got 20 ounces on this just to get it to go straight down uh, to the bottom. And I got 10 on here and it's back, you know, it, it worked back there a little bit before it settled down. Huh? Action time. Mercury. Okay. Or you want mommy to reel it in? I want mommy to reel it in. Can you open this for me? I can't wait to see this fish. Here. <laughs> beef sticks open. The beef sticks. Beef sticks. Had a couple hitchhikers finally wake up and decide to come out on the river with me. It's been a slow morning, slow bite, but yeah, just got and set up. Yeah, again, Corey. <laughs> and it's Corey again. And mommy, you got him, mommy? Yeah. All right, pull straight up. Nice I'm saying nice fishy, nice. <laughs> nice fishy. There's a fish. We got another go. flathead. Back. Where? What kind of fish is this? Flathead. Flathead. <sighs> Come on, that moon eye. When are you going to help me catch bait, Corey? Nine ten years. Ouch. Well, he bit the snot out of me. Yeah, Mommy, you going to hold him? Yes. I'm going <laughs> ribs. <laughs> or glove or something. All right. All right, Corey, you want to tell him what this is named? Slimy Sam. Slimy Sam. Let's put Slimy Sam back. What do you think? Yeah. yeah. He's not big enough. <laughs> Woo! <laughs> he splashed us, didn't he? This is lettuce. It's going to taste like a word ring. Nope. Oh, goodness. Fishy, fishy, fishy. Who's a fishy, fishy, fishy? You real on this one or am I? Daddy is. Is Daddy or one of you two? I wonder, I wonder. Up there. We got a, I think we got a real fish here, Corey. Okay, just like we did yesterday. Let's get over a little bit. What you got, Corey? <laughs> you guys got it? Oh, yeah. Good job. Next fight, I'm going to get the net. Oh, easy. Hold on. Don't reel no more. Don't reel no more. Okay. That's a blue cat girl. No, that's 
It might be. Can I help you grab the rod? And just pull back a little bit. I won't want this, yo. I won't want this. Can I pick up on the rod a little bit? And reel just a little bit? I'm trying to want to show you. There you go. <laughs> awesome. Nice. Eat two. Can I have belly? Yeah. Can I have belly? Saying hello. Hello, little baby. Hey, why am I here? All right, so what are we going to name this one? Biggie. Look, at Molly's got slime all over. Mm -hmm. <laughs> it's Biggie. Look at that. We're going to name this one Biggie, huh? Yeah. Can you say, can you say hi? Can you say bye, Biggie? Bye, Biggie. Stick on your belly. Bye, Biggie Blues. Nice blue cat. A bit bad, would it? I want a better belly. Pet belly. If you feel right there, you can feel something he's ate. Push for hard. You feel it? Feel that lump? Yes. Now, what's this one's name? Ew, you just put your hand in it, but. <laughs> <laughs> uh, you want to say bye bye? Bye-bye, Kissy. Kissy. Mwah. Uh, I want more petty, please. I just want to pet one more time. Oh, no, this is Whew, man or me. Corey, did you have fun? Yes. I hope the geese eat my strawberries. I hope the geese eat your strawberries. Mommy, did you have fun? Oh, yeah. Oh, um, yeah. This doesn't happen too often, folks, and I am very, very happy that uh, they come out and join me for a little bit today. So I hope you enjoyed. Hopefully you learned something. And until next time, God bless and tight lines.